a a r a r square where a is the first term and r is the common ratio of the gp now what is the condition the condition given that the sum of first three terms is 70 therefore a plus a r plus a r square equals to 70 given and if the extreme terms are multiplied by 4 and the middle term is multiplied by 5 then the resulting terms form an ap so uh, according to the question we can write 4 a 4 a 5 a r and 4 a r square forms an ap therefore 5 a r minus 4 a is equals to 4 a r square minus 5 a r now if we take the common then we can write 5 r minus 4 times a equals to 4 r square minus 5 r times a we can cancel out it and we can write 5 r minus 4 equals to 4 r square minus 5 r and again we can write 4 r square minus 10 r my, uh, plus 4 equals to 0 so as for, uh, we can do the middle term so 4 r square minus 8 r minus 2 r plus 4 equals to 0 now we can write 4 r r minus 2 minus 2 if we take the common then we can write r minus 2 equals to 0 and that 4 r minus 2 equal to r minus 2 equals to 0 therefore r equals to 2 by 4 or 2 therefore 1 by 2 r equals to 1 by 2 or 2 if r equals to 1 by 2 then from 1 a plus a by 2 plus a by 4 equals to 70 it gives 4 then 4a plus 2a plus a equals to 70 that means 7a by 4 equals to 70 that means a equals to 40 if r equals to 2 then a plus 2a plus 4a equals to 70 that means 7a equals to 70 it gives a equals to 10 so if a equals to 10 then we need to find that uh, the resulting terms form an ap then the sum of the sum to infinite terms of gp is so the gp uh, now let us write the gp Achha. so 40 into and then r equals to 1 by 2 so 40 into r means 20 and then 1 by r squared that is equals to uh, 1 by 4 that is 10 okay so or or if we take a equals to 10 then 10 then 10 to the 20 and 10 to the 40 so um, from the from we have to find the sum to infinite terms okay so, so we have to find the sum of infinite terms so we can write it is infinity equals to when we are taking 40 as the first term then it will be and, and r was a equals to 40 r equals to 1 by 2 so as r is 1 by 2 less than 1 so we can write it 1 minus 1 by 2 then use the formula and that is 40 into 2 by 2 minus 1 that is equals to 80 okay this is one of the answer and other when all we can write is infinity equals to uh, when a is 10 then it is 10 into 2 minus 1 uh, because um, when a equals to 10 r equals to 2 we should use this formula so 10 by 1 that is equals to 10 so as the answer the option in the option the answer is option b 80 so it will be 80 okay both the answers are correct but in this case you should get 80